So it's finally here. It's everything I worked on uh, last year for about three to four months. It's all the paranoia, infinite whole stuff. <laughs> I'm really excited. I spent so long on this project. Um, I I did all the designs for it, all the inside illustrations. I just didn't do these these lovely covers here. They are lovely. I did do this one though. Here, this one's a cool. These cards. Ah! Okay, one moment and I'll have a look inside Project Infinite Hall box uh, and the main books. So uh, I'm losing a bit of light here. What's that? I don't even know why. Anyway, here are the first lot of cards that come out of the main box set. I spent a long time on these. But yes, I spent a long time illustrating these. There's uh, a lot here. So I'm not taking care. I'm not a professional unboxer. I'm a designer. Yes. Uh, so I spent oh, a long time uh, in the lock-in at home just basically illustrating illustrating all these cards oh, look at these lovely colours look how they shine look at the red oh oh is it good oh yes I'm very chuffed I'm chuffed it's 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 very cool um looking back on it now <laughs> I did an awful lot of work uh on these but uh yeah so just clear these out of the way just move these over here for now yeah good Okay, I've just got to get the, the books out. I'm just doing them with one hand. So, this is the mission book. The cover art there. Very nice. Oh, bye. Shine right. Well done, Shine right. So, inside the mission book, you can see. Oh, these look like some. Uh, Starter character forms. Yeah, pack of uh, six troubleshooters. I really, really enjoyed doing the artwork in this book and the layout. It was super, super duper fun. Uh, I had a lot of freedom with it. I got to try out my my old style, uh, which was a lot of fun. Uh, that's that one. Here we go. This is for the big bad boy game master book. Introduction to the whole campaigns and how it just generally works it's a big fat book that's quite a few pages in that one that's a nice book okay and this one one of my favorites and what some of the cards are based on is uh the catalogue oh a cute little robot with a corpse in the back as as you do but yeah here's some of the r d devices that some of the r d team have created Tire suit. Yeah, that's the main box set. Uh, many cards. These aren't even all the cards. I have even more cards over here, but let's not fling these ones open quite yet because I'll just. I'm running out of table. <laughs> Alright, let's uh, check out the RD testing fun pack. Only a select few people have got these. Limited edition. Really love doing the cover. Just nice and simple dirty paperwork actually when we were unboxing well getting all the boxes up the stairs today literally thought there was a dead fly <laughs> on on uh, the boxes um so i guess i did a good job illustrating the dead fly there let's just get it, let's just get it open it's, it's always easy yes i don't have gloves on i'm not a proper unboxer i'm just an excited creator <laughs> so to begin with we have a know your warnings poster made it's a nice bit of card there Ooh, laminated and shiny so that looks good. Uh, don't judge my bedroom. Yes, I have uh, lots of just rubbish on the side there and a half eaten Easter egg. Don't judge. Um, got some cool little warning signs I made there. They were very fun. I think this was the first thing I created out of the whole box set. All right, next one is a short uh, say adventure campaign called Smocks. A uh, couple. Cool little illustrations and looks like a menacing bad guy there. Mm, wonder what that's reference. Mm, mm. Okay, next thing is the pad of the R and D ex experimental release forms. You need your tongue print to sign off. Uh, so I've just got some empty forms here to uh, yeah play around with making your own experiments and equipment 
uh, don't don't forget to uh, write down your morti uh, mortality rate. So yeah, they were really fun to do too. Look over here. Interesting this pen. Lovely, gorgeous pen. And this one. There we go. Knowing rules is treason. That's a really nice pen. I use that one quite often. Right, got some lovely fuel rods or pencils. They also look very cool. See, fuel rod mini. And here are some collecting cards. Don't have these open at the moment. You might just have to have a look at those ones yourself. But yeah, this is for the select lucky few, uh, few who um, uh, who uh, got the. Um, Okay, as you can tell, I'm very excited. It's just, it's just all, it's all flying everywhere. Okay, let's have a look at some of these other books quickly. So, first one here is a mission book. Another great cover from uh, Cheyenne. Yes, I remember your name, Cheyenne. Right. Yeah. She's one of my favourite illustrations. These two characters pop up quite a lot. I haven't given them, given them a name or uh, anything yet, but. Maybe you guys can can think of a name for them. They're, they're throughout the books. I think they're here as well. Look where they are. They're, they're the best chums. They're good chums. They're, um, but yes, it was a lot of fun illustrating uh, for Paranoia. I hope you guys like the new style. Right, next is the Extension Class Incident uh, Responses book. Um, but yes, this one's got lots of different... Uh, devices and experiments that have all gone wrong somehow uh, that you can basically play through uh, nice little short i think little short uh, adventures and missions uh, yeah look oh it's a thrifty list so thrifty list it's also got some cards there for the thrifty list um and all the devices they're all um there's some uh, extra ones in there though a lot more devices in the in the card box so well worth picking up let's have a quick look through this one i really like this cover didn't take too long to do uh, i mean it took i don't know not very long at all but it ended up looking one of my favorite covers just just silhouettes simplicity is key uh, cute little grenades the grenade box very cute not so cute Ooh. Best armor. That's cool armor. <laughs> this is my first time doing mechs. Uh, I'm more like uh, drawing characters and things. It's, it's quite fun. Anyway, yes. So that's a it's like a, another catalog of more R and D devices to check out. What's this one is Mind the Gap. So it's another campaign or adventure. There we go. It's cool. Yeah. Anyways, yeah. So. All in all, took me about three or four months, maybe a little bit over. Uh, I know you guys have been waiting for a long time for it, but it's finally here. And also, we've got the dice. The dice, the dice, the dice, the dice. Security clearance dice. Let's try and get this open in one hand. Oh, pop it open. Pop it open. Gently. Gently. Put them out on the table. Ooh. There we go. We've got security security clearance dice. That was uh, oh, they look really cute. All the different colours. Nice. Oh yeah, you can get out there. Go on. There we go. Uh, they fit real nice in this box. I really enjoyed uh, working with the printer with this one actually. Just getting it nice and snug, and uh, just fits in there perfectly. It's really sweet. Okay, and here is the disaster deck. Ooh, ah. There we go. Um, it's in cellophane. Right, you're going to have to oh, bear with me. So here's the disaster deck. Uh, they are action cards, but with a little bit of a twist. Let's have a look. Oh, there's a lot of disaster in them. Focus. Mm. Okay. Uh, these ones are starting to get a bit more on my stride, doing the artwork. Laying them out. Yeah. But yes, they're very cool. Yes. 
Anyway, here it is in all its glory. <laughs> like, I know it looks like a mess at the moment, but I am really, really proud of this. Um, uh, it took me a really long time. It's the first time I I had to work on a Kickstarter and work on such a, a large project, uh, basically with myself and the writers, and I have to thank the rest of the team for helping me out with that. But uh, they gave me a lot of freedom on the artwork. Uh, I got to make some really cool videos as well. It really got me warmed up to Mongoose Publishing and uh, all the ins and outs of the printing process and uh, laying out and making cards and books and working with other illustrators. But yeah, it turned out really nice. Um, so I hope you're all excited in all its glory right here. Okay. Anyway, uh, I'll see you about and uh, look after yourself, troubleshooters. And uh, obey the computer. Alright, ta-da! Bye!